Have you ever wondered why do we need an attribute ng project s in Angular? This is a special construct that allows the creation of content projection aliases. Let's have a look at the use case where it might be really useful. Imagine that you've got a third party component with the projection slot that projects elements with an attribute header. This means that you can simply introduce a header attribute in the projecting content and it will work. However, it might happen that in the same view, you all also have to use a directive that has the same selector as the one needed for the content projection. And this naming collision might bring some unwanted behavior to the element you are going to project. In this case, you can use the projection alias to project content under the proper selector and avoid activating the directive on this element. To learn more advanced tips about content projection in Angular, please check out my complete guide about this topic on my YouTube channel Decoded Frontend.